Guys, Coach Joe back with you again here with Coach Shaw. And we're wrapping up the last part of our series talking about proper breathing and bracing. So we talked about in part one with our upper body stability, part two with our lower body stability, and this is gonna kind of be the glue that holds everything together. So when we're talking about proper breathing and bracing, what we're really trying to establish here is a rigid and upright torso. Specifically with a high bar back squat, the whole point is to be able to stay more upright to engage the core and hit more of a quad focus on here. So we really need to be able to get that breathing and bracing on point so that way we can do that. So when we're talking about breathing and bracing, we wanna take a big breath in at the beginning of that rep and cinch and brace down, but what we don't want is to be able to take that big breath in through the chest. What we want is to be able to take a big breath in the belly. So that belly button should be extending out, cinched down, and that's what's gonna help us to keep that nice rigid torso. So Coach Shaw, he's gonna demo a squat for us, kind of pulling all three of those pieces together. So we've got our hand placement set, he's gonna pull himself under the bar, bar sits right on top of the traps. Walking out, we're gonna get set from here. So he's screwing the feet into the ground, he's gonna take that big breath in the belly, brace down, and as he starts to descend, he's spreading the floor, creating tension through the hips, exhaling at the top, one more rep, Spreading the floor, big brace, exhaling at the top. So there you have it guys, there's our three checkpoints. We've got our upper body stability, our lower body stability, and what we talked about in this video, our proper breathing and bracing to tie it all together. So subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tutorials just like this. Thanks guys.